You're tuning into Black and White Sports on YouTube. The no holds barred truth on sports. The main event starts now. I'm back. Rodrance for Black and White Live. Oh, it's amazing how many people believe it is their right to, by God, know your vaccination status. And when at the end of the day, all you did was go to a football game. To watch your husband play football. Well, we know all the controversy that has surrounded the Buffalo Bills, Cole Beasley, Jordan Poirier, maybe Josh Allen, nobody knows for sure, and Jordan Poirier's wife, Rachel Bush, who is an Instagram model. And, well, she went to, of course, as you would expect, go out and support her husband at the Buffalo Bills Washington football team game. And that sent the woke mob into a tizzy, demanding action be taken against Rachel Bush because they just don't quite know what her status is. Wow. I cannot believe we're in a place and a time where people believe it is literally their business to know what kind of medical treatment you're getting. That's amazing to me. That's a, that's, it's, it's baffling. It's crazy. Okay, again, we don't care if you if you went and got 12 vaccines. Congratulations. Okay? That's your business. If you didn't, that is also your business. It's freedom. It's America. It's supposed to be. Last I checked. Well, let's dig into this. This is from the guys at Outkick. The Vax mob demands answers from Rachel Bush on how she attended the Bills game. Oh god. Wow. Now the Vax Mob, who is this? Joe Kinsey. Now the Max Mob, which has been fighting with great American Rachel Bush, the wife of Buffalo Bill safety, Jordan Poirier, is really fired up. Oh, they're mad as hell. They're mad as hell. The mob wants answers as to how outspoken vaccine critic attended Sunday's game at Ralph Wilson Stadium when the county government has an ironclad jab mandate on the facility. There are multiple conspiracy theories floating around. People are wasting their time on this. Think about this. They're literally, this is something they're losing literal minutes of their own life on, including Rachel lying to social media community about her vaccine status. There's also a segment of the Vax mob who want to know if Rachel has access to a, you know, a card that might not be truly accurate that displayed her status. The mob is shouting on post. I'm trying to clean this up for YouTube, guys. And then there are those who want to know if the local government has made an insider deal with player wives and girlfriends. The mob thanks cops. Oh, God. The mob thanks cops are letting hot wives and girlfriends cruise in the stadiums. Good grief. I mean, really? This guy. So it's Rachel Bush, A, a criminal with a fake card, B, a fraud, 3, at Buffalo Bills and at Mark Poland cars. By the way, he's this ultra woke, caught up in the vaccine political figure up there around Buffalo are selective on who the policy gets enforced on. Quote, I love the cops and the staff at the Bill Stadium. Just amazing, Bush said, Sunday after her team destroyed the WFT 43-21. to w- WTF, playing more like it. And that set off the Vax mob on a wild goose chase. Their heads are spinning. How did she pull it off? Which politician is in on it? She's a fraud. So, hey, Rachel Bush finally got a vaccine shot. Parentheses doubtful. Melissa Burris, you really need to get a life. B, a, a fake card, a literal crime. C, quote, an exception being made for a player's wife. Would love to hear the explanation. Why? Why? Why do you need to hear the explanation? Who gives a rat's ass? I mean, come on. This guy said at least one unvaccinated individual got into the Bills game with maybe a fake card. Hmm, Rachel. This is crazy. 
If you're into vaxxed mobs losing their mind in soap operas, this is definitely a storyline you'll want to follow. It'll be interesting if the mob will work hard enough to get a response out of moron tough politician Mark Polencars, who Bush has gone after in the past. Quote, there is no God-given right to attend a football game, Poland Cars declared in the spring as Bush was unloading on the guy. Will Mark get into a vaxxed off with Bush? Stay tuned. This this one uh, posted here. Good luck filling the stadium with only vaccinated people. Yeah. Doesn't look like they're struggling without you. Looks like Rachel is there, either a hypocrite or got the vaccine or has a fake card. And then they're calling for the politician to get involved again. She tweeted, I love you all, regardless of your vaccination status, even if you are cis. (laughs) And then Rachel said, I love you all, regardless of your vaccination status, even though it's obsessed with whether or not others got vaccinated. You get love too. Laugh out loud. I'm sure you'll come back to your senses one day. Don't count on it, Rachel. And this is Rachel right here on her on her Insta face. There we go. That is that is Jordan Poirier's wife. Um, you're welcome, Black and White Live fans. Here you go. Yeah. 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 So, she looks plenty healthy to me. Um, I don't know that uh, plenty healthy there. She's healthy. Yeah. So, uh, can you believe that this is what people are worried about? Tell me what you think, Black and White Live fans. This is ridiculous. Peace. I'm out. Till next time. Thanks for watching the show. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Be sure to tune in next time on Black and White Sports.